Hi, I'm Sean Gannett, and this is Minute Math, and today we're learning about logarithmic equations. Minute Math, Minute Math, when you need help you use Minute Math. We're given this problem right here. The natural log of 2 minus the natural log of 3x plus 2, that's equal to 1. And we have to solve this equation. Now this is a special one, it's going to be a little difficult. This is the same, we're going to use this formula right here. We're subtracting a log with the same base, in this case it's base e, and we'll see that in a little bit. And in doing so, we can combine it to be one logarithm, but with division on the inside. So, this can become the natural log of 2 divided by the 3x plus 2, and that's going to equal the 1. And remember when I said natural log is equal to log base e? We're going to need that here. So we have the log base e instead of natural log of 2 over 3x plus 2. Now, you won't always have to do this step, but it makes it a little easier to see. From there, we're going to use our top formula. Our base is e, and so we have that b value, e. We're going to raise it to what we're equal to, which is 1, which is nice. And that's going to be equal to what we're taking the logarithm of, our a value, which is that 2 over 3x plus 2. Okay? From there, okay, it's a little tricky. We want to get x by itself, okay? So what I'm going to do here, I'm going to multiply the 3x to both sides, a 3x plus 2 to both sides, like so. That cancels, and we're left with, well, e times a 3x plus 2, and that's equal to 2. I'm going to divide both sides by e, as such, I have 3x plus 2 equals 2 over e. Okay, almost there. Let's subtract the 2 to both sides. What do we get? I'm going to put that up here. Let's get some space here. So we have 3x. Uh, ah, I wrote a 2. Getting ahead of myself here. That's all right. Take our time. No need to rush this. 3x is equal to now 2 over e, and that's minus a 2. Okay? Well, I want to combine these, and so if I subtract a 2, I don't have the same base, but if I multiply this by an e over e, I will. So it's like a minus 2 is the same as minus a 2e over e. We now have 3x equals, combine it, 2 minus 2e over 1e right there. We want to get the 3 over to the right-hand side, so I'm going to multiply this by a 1 third to both sides. That cancels a 3, x is by itself. We have a 2 minus a 2e still in the numerator, and e times 3 is a, well, a uh, 3e, drawing a blank right there. Okay. Whew. Either way, our final answer here is nothing really more we can do to simplify this, is x equals 2 minus 2e over a 3e. I hope this video was helpful for you, and if it was, please subscribe to this YouTube channel and like this video. This helps us make more free math lessons for you and for everyone else. So as always, thanks for watching. Minute math, minute math, when you need help you use minute math.